five coins are tossed simultaneously so number of times our experiment is repeated or we can write number of times coins are tossed it is represented by n always equals to 5 find the probability of getting head 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 all head so our success is head failure is tail so let's write probability of head let's suppose this is success write p what will be probability it is favorable case divided by total case and favorable is one head divided by total head and tail two face so one by two similarly for failure op opposite of head it is tail so probability of tail we represent by q equals to again for tail also this is tail and there are total two faces so tail face divided by total two face we got p and q we got n now let's solve one number here at first let's write formula probability of r required success probability of required success is given by ncr multiply with p power r and q power n minus r this all are under multiplication so one number probability probability of no head means probability of zero head equals to n means 5 5 c 0 multiply with 1 by 2 power r r means 0 1 by 2 power 0 and q means also 1 by 2 1 by 2 power n is 5 so 5 minus 0 how much will this be 1 5 c 0 5 c 0 equals to 1 1 this will be also 1 5 minus 0 it will be 1 by 2 power 5 finally it is 1 by 2 power 5 is 32 yes 1 by 32 so we got the probability it is 1 by 32 for two number what we need is only one head let's write probability of only one head this is given by probability of one head equals to 5 c1 multiply with 1 by 2 power 1 and 1 by 2 power n minus r it is 5 minus 1 so directly write here 4 5 c1 is how much 5 5 c1 yes 5 c1 equals to 5 1 by 2 power 1 1 by 2 power 4 total 1 by 2 power 5 2 power 5 is how much 2 power 5 is 32 so let's write 5 by 32 direct now number 3 probability of exactly two head probability of exactly two heads it means we are we have thrown this for five times one times two times three times four times five times in any of these times let's suppose here and here we got two head it means exactly two head other all we got tail in first case in first toss we get tail second toss also we get tail third toss we get head and fourth toss we get head and in fifth case we get tail so it is telling like this so p bracket 2 this will be 5c2 multiplies with 1 by 2 power 2 and 1 by 2 power 5 minus 2 5 minus 2 is 5 minus 2 3 okay this is 5c2 5c2 is 10 1 by 2 power 2 1 by 2 power 3 2 plus 3 5 this will be 2 power 5 just now i have said 32 10 by 32 it is 5 by 6 so let's write 5 by oh 16 5 by 16 thing now at least one head oh this is very easy probability of at least one head it is given by at least one head means if we get one head it is okay if we get two head it is also okay because at least we have one head three head also okay we, we can accept because we have at least one head four head is also okay if we get five head that also okay because we need at least one head so any one is okay so it is the sum of one head or two head or three head also we can accept we can accept 
फोर टाइम्स हेड ऑल्सो और समटाइम्स वी कैन एक्सेप्ट फाइव हेड ऑल्सो इट इज एट लीस्ट वन हेड विच विज वैल्यू वी हैव वन हेड टू हेड वी हैव टू वैल्यू फाइव बाई थर्टी टू एंड फाइव बाई सिक्सटीन वी हैव बट पी थ्री वी डोट हैव वी हैव टू फाइंड पी वन और पी टू तो यहाँ से पी थ्री इसी था पाने सेम फर्मुला फाइव बाई सिक्सटीन पी फोर फाइव बाई थर्टी टू पी फाइव वन बाई थर्टी टू ओके नाउ लेट्स कॉपी पी थ्री इज फाइव बाई सिक्सटीन पी फोर फाइव बाई थर्टी टू पी फाइव वन बाई थर्टी टू नाउ डोंट यूज माइंड यूज कैलकुलेटर सेव टाइम देन आउ मट इट इज इट इज थर्टी वन बाई थर्टी टू राइट हेयर थर्टी वन बाई थर्टी टू इट्स द एंसर वी गॉट वन एंसर टू एंसर थ्री एंसर ऑल एंसर बी रेडी फॉर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन